So now this is my lecture on the use of 3D ultrasound in the first trimester scan. But I don't like to speak only of 3D because you don't do only 3D. When you do the first trimester scan, you will use first 2D. And if there is a need to, to use, you will use a 3D ultrasound. So it's, you cannot do a complete examination only with 3D. You need 2D and 3D. And what is the purpose of the first trimester fetal ultrasound scan? It's to confirm the viability, to establish the gestational age, to count the number of fetuses, assess chorionicity, amniocity in a multiple pregnancy, doing the nuchal translucency sickness, and this is an ID for screening of chromosomal defect, and especially for the uh, Down syndrome. And also it's possible to detect all the major fetal abnormalities. And this, if it is, it is in these points that the 3D is a really a benefit because you can demonstrate all this uh, malformation. So when you, you want to do this examination, you have to choose your, what kind of probe you will use. You can use different probes. You can use a two-dimensional probe, abdominal probe, and this is a linear one with a high frequency. And this one is a 2D and 3D probe, abdominal approach also. And this is a transvaginal probe, and you can also do 2D and 3D. And during the 11 to 14 weeks, I always start with abdominal probe. And uh, I prefer to use this kind of probe because I, if I want to switch from 2D to uh, 3D, I just have to press on one button. If I use this kind of probe, the 2D, if I want to do 3D, I have to change the probe and to take the 3D probe. And this is when I do uh, transvaginal.